This one I took. When I was around 15, I went to stay with them. And she was out tanning her moose hide, like this is a fresh hide, right? She's mm -hmm. fleshing it right now. And then she looked up at me just at that second and I snapped it. <laughs> it's one of my favorite pictures of her. Because that's how I remember her the best. It's, uh, it's, it's crazy to imagine that there's so much land up here. It didn't even feel like I was working, I was just here enjoying Tombstone. Being able to have a job like that is pretty it's special. Out. We go up the Dempster a lot, and Tombstone Center itself, you know, Grandma and Grandpa had a huge part of that being built. If they were both here today, they'd be sitting around that little stove, you know, drinking the tea and enjoying the company. My grandma and grandpa, Joe and Annie Henry, they were very involved with the whole land claims process. And they were very concerned about it being protected. Even though you have all this vast land around you, it was, I think, in a lot of ways, confining because of the Western laws that came into play. Everybody's family is important in my view because there's so many different family names, but everybody comes from one of them. It's not about us, it's about uh, our great-grandchildren, that they get to enjoy the same, same privileges that we do today. She thinks she's just maintaining those trails, but you know, those trails are very important. You're continuing and keeping that tradition going, and that's important, you know, for, for us to continue to use that land as that's what they would have wanted. Shut up.